State leaders presenting a new initiative designed to tackle this state's backlog of court cases. News News' Aaron Morgan joins us in this studio. And Aaron, today you listened in as Attorney General Alan Wilson gave more details about this proposal. Yeah, today Attorney General Alan Wilson and the Speaker of the South Carolina House, Merle Smith, shared details about the program, which is known as the Statewide Violent Crimes Reduction Unit. Representative Smith says right now there are over 11,000 pending general session indictments over three years old in South Carolina. Attorney General Alan Wilson says he attributes a lot of the backlog to the pandemic. He explained that the statewide violent crimes reduction unit would work within the attorney general's office and visit solicitors across the state to assist them with cases and help them chip away at the backlog. Wilson says they would employ four prosecutors, two paralegals, two investigators, one IT technician and one victim advocate. The teams will be split into two prosecutors, an investigator and a paralegal, and they will share the victim's advocate and the IT person. So each unit will be deployed to a circuit that needs that bandwidth support, and they will focus on getting that docket under control when the solicitor needs it. Attorney General Wilson's budget request for the unit is roughly $1.6 million for the employee salaries and the travel costs. In the studio, I'm Erin Morgan. Count on two.